our way to a live auction this morning, which is the first one that we've had since probably last year, just because of the whole situation everywhere. So hopefully they got five units. Hopefully there's not five million people there to bid on them. It's this unit or this place typically emails people, but they do put list or listing in the public notices as well. But we're almost there. Just had to fight through some accidents on the highway to get here. But another five minutes and I'll be there. And you probably can't hear anything over my truck though. It's so loud in here. But just heading up. We're in Central Oregon. Bend. Bend. Bend, Oregon. Trying to get to the. There's Pilot facility. Butte over there. Mountains are behind us. If you look in the mirror. I don't know if I can get it. No, uh, it's just you, know, you can turn around and probably see. Oh. But we're almost there. We'll just see how many people are there, and then we'll turn you off until the auction is done, and see if there's anything worth us bidding on. We still have stuff from our 14 by 40 unit that we haven't even Three looked sisters. at yet. So. Three sisters and what? What's over there? Uh, Washington, Jefferson. There's the old mill. There's lots of shopping down there. Uh, we're almost there, just across this road here. Well, the auction starts at 11, and it is it's 10 of. <laughs> so we're cutting it close. Bouncy. Yeah, we're cutting it close. I'm getting there in time, but. But I'm curious to see how many cars are here. Usually there's no parking. Yeah, they have a pretty small parking lot at this facility, so unless they have the gates open, there's which they don't do, there's no parking on like there's like three three parking spots up at the facility. And then the rest is across the street. So, we're getting there, I think I can see the sign up there. Stop sign and it's just right there. Straight ahead. Did you say there was five units? Yeah, there's five units. We're just hoping there's not gonna be 20 people there and that way we'll have at least a chance to get something for a decent price. It's right in other and it's 500 like a, feet. Oh yeah, I see it. Yeah, so. Plus it's a really nice day today. Yeah. It's comfortable Not weather. Yeah, I don't even see any cars in the parking lot. You better be having I'm sure it. this is the place. Yeah. I'm sure. <laughs> I see zero cars. Oh my gosh. Which oh they got the gates open. I don't know if they're so, having people. No, no it's, it's, it's shutting. Up. So we're like the first ones here, looks like. We're the only ones. Actually we are Public twenty minutes auction. early. I thought we were almost late. Ten minutes early. It says oh, auction today. Sign. Their sign says 11. So we'll see if anyone else shows up for this auction. And oh, we just need one more person to show up or yeah. else they'll cancel. This happened to me last time at this facility. Is I came, it was midweek, and they sent an email out like the same day that the auction was. I just happened to be doing nothing for work. So I came down, it was me and one other guy showed up at like five minutes before the auction. I ended up, he had bid me up on a unit, but it's still, we probably made like two or three thousand on that Yeah, unit. that was a great unit. That was a really good unit. So, fingers crossed someone shows up so we can actually have this auction. Well, only one customer in the office so. at a time. So, I'll go sign in with my face mask. My face mask, so we're all legal. But see you guys in a little bit. Okay. Oh, maybe they haven't put the code in yet. Like, added our code to the thing. Oh, darn. Hang on. Well, we're at this unit here that we came to the live auction. It ended up being only four people total, including us. Yeah, it's not working. Not working. Okay, we gotta go get another code or well, something. Well, no, they probably just haven't put the code in yet. Activated our code. Anyway, we ended up getting one small one, all decent size for 50 bucks. I think that was a pretty good deal. 
We're gonna show you once we get into this place. Yeah. <laughs> it was another one that was so big and That's really good. If we had space, we would have bought it. Yeah. Access denied. Bad passcode. Yeah, so okay. they maybe just don't have it in the Finally got it in straight here. forward. But we're here. We finally got access to the unit. <laughs> the code. Actually, I think it's that next aisle. The code wasn't working for some reason. They could see that it wasn't working. So she's just like, choose a number. And we'll use that code. So it's 193, which is right up here, right here. I think it's only, I think it's 10 by 10 is what they said. So. Let's see what we got in here. We get into it. So, we've only just seen it. Just from the door, if I can get the lock open now. That'll kill my It's dusty. The thing I saw first, before even the swords that are right up here, is this right here. I didn't even know what to it me, was. To me, it looks to be a pottery wheel. It's older, but we used to run these when I was in high school. Electric pottery wheel. And my niece is, wants to do pottery, so if we can help her out and get her a pottery wheel for pretty cheap. There's also like one of those paddleboard things up there like two bikes at least a couple sets of skis you know just a bunch of stuff but i mean walking sticks looks like a nice tripod. little tripod that we could golf, use couple golf clubs a fishing rod a, a scanner so, a printer that's no good but then, which i'm surprised like, nobody bid on this, this unit, unit nobody bid on 50 dollars and you have... we're the only ones that I even know. made a bid. Some guy was standing here, said he'd give us $10 for the sword. Uh, I could probably get $10 in scrap for the sword with between the brass handle. And, and then there's a bunch of little everything. daggers. Yeah, there's something. a bunch of them in here. So no. nobody else wanted this. We probably could have got it for 25 if we If we would have waited a couple anything. more seconds, yeah. yeah. We could have got it for a little cheaper, but... Then you have to deal with these yeah. tires, though. That's yeah. a pain. Got a set of tires there. Oh, probably actually six lug. They're probably off a of Chevy. They probably fit on your Forerunner. Some artwork. 235. They're a little smaller though. Books. Maybe on a Jeep or something. I didn't I don't see know what that. A Jeep takes. Oh, that's a yeah. Suitcase. Suitcase. Yeah. Yeah. There's not that much in here. There's a few boxes. There's some artwork here. A couple rugs. Glue. <laughs> a jumpy thing but I didn't even see that so I did and that was the one thing I was like oh trash kids toy stuff you know like some old shovels that's a saw no hand saw yeah <laughs> so, looks like some pots that I might keep yeah nice garden pots oh look at this I can't really see look no, at already, that fancy putter I I just said some go oh man, this stuff's been in here for yeah. they said a, over here a year because I haven't been able to have an auction. So for fifty dollars, mm. I think we'll make our money back. <laughs> I I know we'll make our money back right in the back there. If that's well, in there, you don't know what's in it. Yeah. If it's in there and it's in good shape, we'll make our money back. Just on and that. And the skis have the poles, which is that one set does. Yeah, yeah. So you know, and the bikes look good. I mean, it's hard to tell from here, but. I might have myself a new bicycle, not the one with the. You don't need a new bicycle. Seat on it. So well. But yeah. Because we'll get, I don't we'll know. We get loading up because we don't have a whole yeah. lot of time today. We gotta go to golf. Yeah. Match. Which it looks like that rack there is like a sword rack or something. Oh maybe. Almost. Yeah. Actually, there's even a pair of ski boots up here. 
They look older, but... And then it looks like they were doing some pottery here. Yeah, sculpting. Okay. Sculpting, so... This place at least takes back personal stuff if there's anything personal, which it looked like a box in the back there said, like, decor... Uh, maybe that, maybe Decorations, it, it says. Maybe I just read it wrong. So, but you see a moving label sticker back there on that well, headboard. That doesn't mean anything. I know it doesn't mean they've moved once before at least. Yeah. But we're pretty much just gonna load this stuff up because we don't have time. So, so. this is um, gonna be Ben Century Storage. Yeah. Unit <laughs> when we start doing the <laughs> we'll unboxing stuff. Yeah, so we just we're just gonna it. move it all right now. We just sold. Something yeah, similar to this. Yeah, people buy these little billy club things. But, but we'll see if eBay will let us sell it. Mm -hmm. uh, like a couple pair looks like almost. No, that's wood, I guess. Nunchucks, homemade. Uh, that's, that's like an axe or something. Ice axe, ice. Thing. A machete. Actually, that's a pretty nice case. Mm -hmm. Too bad it's got a sticker on there. But, you know, it sounds like someone's trying to get by me. I don't know if they got plenty of room now. Well, any treasures? Yeah. Well, you got, I don't know if those are deep, but, well, not quite half, I guess, cleaned out. Actually, we might throw that. Actually, I think we got We half. might throw that other board up on top of the truck. Because oh, you want to get to it. Can... We're just. Uh, leave the trash so we got <laughs> the tires out of here. There's a bunch of paintings, a bunch of ceramic stuff. We got that potter's wheel out of here. The guard, splash garden stuff was in there. So we got some artwork, like it's on glass or something there that you got to be careful with. But you got a bed frame, some tires, all that stuff. There's a few totes of books. <laughs> and then, yeah. So there's all the painting stuff. It was a, uh, like, drum. Drum, there was a Dakine little carry bag for traveling or something. I can't tell what, it might have had skis or something in it. It's probably what it was for. Some kind of projector thing here. Uh, what did that say? I don't know. <laughs> I forget what it says. Something about radio. But we're going to have to definitely come back and get the rest of this. There's a lot, of, a lot more in a lot more than it looked like. Jeez, I don't know what's <laughs> happening there. Anyway. So, we'll show definitely you. be back. We got show two bikes back there. Stuff. Got two sets of skis. That stand on water type of board back there. Mm -hmm. Some pads. We're going to have to move my truck. So. All right, we'll see we'll you next time. Right. Going? Yeah. So, we came back for our last load, same day. And got it all cleaned out in my truck. That's two loads. Everything fit in two loads. There's just a there's truck. some trash. But there's back seats full as well. Not as much. There's some trash. Not really just a lot of trash pads. Though. All these pads. Just that. Maybe that picture has a rip in it. Yeah. Not too much other stuff is trash, but the, the key is we got it all loaded in two loads in one day. Now we just lock it up and they're going to be closed tomorrow is the only thing to get our deposit back but we'll come back monday morning and get the deposit and we'll be done so we'll let you know if there's anything yeah, good we'll, in this when we start going through it once we start going and tackling this we're still working on our 14 by 40 so once we get that one kind of squared away we can take care of this we might video some of this for or all of this first and just put it on at a later date just so we can get this done and keep it separated from that other unit. But we'll see you when we get done. Bye. I'm fine. So I'm We brought all this stuff from that last live auction back to the house and we ended up putting the shed up for the kids' bikes to go and golf clubs to go in, but we're temporarily using it just so we don't have to rent another unit. Temporarily. Yeah, temporarily. That's the key. So we're gonna go through some of this stuff today and see what we can find. We got the air conditioner in the background running right now, so hopefully it shuts off soon. You don't have to listen to that the whole time. But it's been 
in the hundreds the last couple days, so we haven't even been doing anything outside. So we're just finally getting to this. It's already Friday, so we bought it on last Saturday. So we'll just start in. This one says food, dry goods, but looks like it's closed. board with chess pieces. Magnetic chess. Mouse trap? <laughs> I hope not. No. Some kind of lighting. They're <laughs> only a dollar. But they're like track lighting. There's three of them in here. But that's much it. Oh, there's Jersey. something in here, but it's like a hockey shirt. Oh. Is that like a team? NHL. Uh, I don't know, it doesn't. Uh, Western Conference. I don't know what that team is. Oakland A's. <laughs> I don't know. Is that baseball? <laughs> What's yeah, Oakland A's? That's, is that even a thing? It is the NHL close, so. <laughs> yep, yeah, that's it on that one. Whew, Let's see. Where all those feathers came from. What's wrong, Rocky? What are you doing? What? It's supervising. I know, it's looking for Oh, this is a heavy one. More of those pieces of that pottery. Oh, that you're right. We shouldn't have thrown it. Well, they're in your truck if you really want to. I think some of them might have got seven. broken when we oh. gently threw them away. So they were building something with those pottery pieces. I kind of think it's like a school, yeah, like maybe college art class or something. So that going to be pretty much this whole box is just going to go right in the back of my truck with the rest of them. Cause I don't know what else to do with them. I'm not very, it's just a bunch of heavy, Shot, Rocky. heavy stuff. Dog smells. We just barely put this shed up last week. Oh, and the dog probably smells whoever we bought her from. Making kind a of table? Yeah, somewhat of a table. If you can see. Oh, oh is like that the old jog, jog strap? <laughs> yeah, it's an old catcher's mitt. I don't know, it's rolling. Grand. Uh, this was part of a piece of something here, like a sea urchin that's missing a bunch of its legs. That's like Play-Doh. It's just clay. <laughs> yeah, it's like... Alright. Get this stuff out of here. What, is it dusty or something? Sure. On that, we got like some more pottery stuff. I mean, that's kind of cool little stingray. But that's like plate or silly putty or something. Oh, this looks like some stuff I made in pottery glass. But like that's. Just bisque fire there. 
balsa airplane. I don't know what this, this is just going to be <laughs> pretty much, I don't think there's anything in there worth anything, didn't look like. Just the I don't know one. what this thing is. No, there's something they made. Seeing as if weaving something, but that's going to be trash. We're just trying to load up my truck before the weekend so we can get rid of it. But basically, we've kept the pitcher or the catcher's mitt so far. Hey, get out of there. Then, we've got some kind of body gear. This, oh, it's for biking. Some bike, some bike park. Uh, I'm gonna see where. It doesn't, it doesn't say matter place, where it is. Like that's so nice. like protective rock. Some kind of jacket, yeah. like with all kinds of pads on it, <coughs> to keep you from getting hurt. I guess when you crash. Not, not if you crash, but when you crash. Hey, get out of there. I got a back, back support thing here, armadillo looking. Well, that stuff will probably sell. We get, you know, I don't know if you want to show them the bike that's out there. The two bikes, I guess. Wait up. In those two bikes, this orange one there is, I forget what, Nolly or something? Yeah, Nolly brand. We looked it up. It's like, what, $1,700 or something? Mm, it just depends on what. Just depends on exactly this which is. one, but positive, yeah. set up all like this. And this is like a, just a mountain bike. The other one is awesome, which also is a pretty expensive bike as well. So, and we only paid fifty dollars for the unit, so hopefully the bike's at least worth a hundred. <laughs> so double our money right there. Pottery? Well, no, nope. <laughs> it's like index card. bunch of their oh schoolwork from the from the eighties and nineties. Wow. From the nineties because I used these when I was in college. One hundred and forty-four megabytes of space on each one of those babies, and they had an old Apple computer. It's a uh, M zero zero. Zero one computer that was in a bag with the keyboard and uh, like a number pad thing. So, I mean, that was pretty unique in itself. And this looks like more stuff possible. What's a key? <laughs> looks like more stuff Apple possibly stuff. to that same computer. Wow. Yeah, this is all yeah. Apple. I looked up That's that the computer. external drive right there. Those are actually. It didn't even have that stuff with it and it sold yeah. for 500. Yeah, the external drives that said online, like showed online, were selling, like those were the high points for that. There's like a controller. There's a mouse that came in the bag with the, with the Apple. And if this is the, no, that, I was gonna say if it's the program discs, I mean it's in a little Apple, Apple box. If it's the program disks, then it jumps up the value of the computer by the computer as well. Well, just the case that it's in is worth $40. Yeah. Also. Carry so, case. Get I mean, out of there. That's, that we'll have to put with the computer and see what see what we can do with that. Well, that's put that Macintosh. Yeah. Apple Macintosh. Apple right there. 
So we'll have to look through all these discs, see if there's, like, those look like all program discs back in the back here. And that is, yeah, we'll have to look at, keep that, just, just to see where it goes. Huh? Key. But we'll have to put this in the house with the computer. That and this so far are good. I know. Blew apart. And that is. Is that a yearbook? Um, I have no idea. Hmm. Huh. Yeah, it's like art. Just all pictures of different buildings. buildings. We'll have to look through some of this. To look the books up because some books are worth money. You wouldn't. Yeah. Be surprised. Yeah, we'll have to just look them up and see what see what those are. So, I mean, we got loads of bugs, like always. So. <laughs> like I was saying, we got a lot of books to go through. You know, some are not in perfect shape, but you know, Emperor and the Kite. I don't know what what it is, but like they had a, a lot of Oriental type of things. And just art stuff, though. A lot of art. Because that's the same first name that's on one of those books. That may just be the artist or whoever took the. Maybe it's the place, I don't know. And then you have this Guide to Extraterrestrials. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. The whole see it. title. That's different. I was kind of curious about this. The old it's looking. leather back. Yeah, feel, feels leather. So World Atlas, we'll see, see what year, yeah, it's not in the perfect shape, but. Copyright, uh, it's all Roman numerals. 19, probably, uh, 41 maybe? Or Seems older than that. Or 43. Huh? Really? Seems older than that. Well, you could probably look it up, but. Well, get a, anyway. Get a translator for it. You probably <laughs> shouldn't Roman take numerals. so much time on the yeah, book that's, box. I mean, that's an older book for sure. It's leather bound. So, yeah, we'll get to another box. That is. I don't know. I mean, some. Odd. I know they're interesting, though. Oops. Part of that look. Oh, oh, it's it's like a outside sleeve. Oh, the Raven by Edgar Allan Poe. Really? Oh wow. Uh, what year? 1930. 39. Oh yeah, 1930. And it's in like a box, which isn't in very good shape. But if that's like. A real early one that could be worth something. Anyway, it's just a replica. It's a replica and not worth anything. But Hunters of the Dunes. They, it's like just random, all different kinds of books. You want to move that suitcase, and I'll just set this on the floor and start setting stuff on top of it. Locked in here. So. Books. More books. Pottery books. Yep. Pottery. Film making. Oh, all kinds of pottery books. Making pottery. Yeah. Ceramics. Kilns. More of those. I don't even know if I can lift this one. 
or those pieces of pottery that look like a puzzle. It's not that bad, except for everything else falling on me. Look, look, look though, and make sure that's all. Uh, there's like a couple of these type of things in here. Let's see if I can break them. Like flower pot oh, looking wow. things. Those aren't bad. Mm. Uh, handmade. It's like there have only been bisque fired, like no glaze. So they're not actual glass yet. But that's those, and there's more of those puzzle piece looking things that are in this box. I mean, and that's like three or four pounds. And there's a few of them. Then we just got two of those, like looks like flower pot type of pot, uh, things there. Do you want to make some room before? Yeah, we... we'll <laughs> we'll take some of this stuff and just stick it in my truck for the dump, and we'll stack this stuff outside so we got more room in here to go through some stuff. And we'll see you in a few minutes.